And when it comes to domestic violence, there are organizations across eastern North Carolina that specialize in helping victims and survivors. Now your sides, Nye Remy has been talking to a local advocate. She's joining us now in the studio. So Nye, what are they telling you? Well, Courtney, advocates say domestic violence is common across America as it affects over 10 million pe people every year. Now the North Carolina Coalition Against Domestic Violence says one in three women and one in four men have experienced some form of physical violence by their partner. They say in North Carolina, more than 35% of women and 30% of men will experience that and stalking in their life. Erin Pasalag with SAFE in Lenore County says, domestic violence isn't always physical at first. She says these are some signs to look out for. Wanting control, your partner isolating you from your family or friends, manipulation, and verbal abuse. They're not getting in fights at work. They're not beating up their brother or, you know, other friends or people in the community. They're, they're choosing to be violent with this one person. And what we usually hear is, well, why doesn't she just leave? Why didn't she just leave? Why aren't people asking the question, why is this person abusing? Experts say it can be hard for the victim to leave when they've been isolated from family and friends and the abuser makes them believe nobody is there for them. Pasaleg says it takes a person on average seven times until they finally leave their partner. If you are a victim of domestic violence or know someone who is, National Domestic Violence Hotline is on your screen. It's 800-7997-233. Local advocates say no one deserves to be abused and it's not your fault. In studio, Nairemi, nine on your side. Nine, thanks.